All right, everyone, we have made it to Mazatlan. It's so humid. That is one thing we've not experienced so far. This is the first time. It's really humid, like sticky humid. But we're gonna go have great breakfast and figure shit out and move on because that's what we do. Looking for a place to stay. How much is it coming in Mexican? Click it's click. 71 in USD. That's what it shows me. Your cool, cool. first impressions of Mazatlan. It's pretty. It's cute. We had really good brunch. Met some amazing people. <laughs> and now we are in desperate need of... Amazing people are stuck with us. <laughs> yeah. Trying to find a pet friendly place. Now we are like trying to find a place to sleep because we are tired. Once we wake up, then we will update you guys. Something seriously has gone wrong with our van's front suspension. Look at this. That doesn't look right. We are in the Airbnb, we don't have a high-end property because we are cheap and we are in the budget, we have seen a local community in a non-tourist area. There is a metal door in the entrance, then we will open it, then there is a dog, 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 then there is a dog. So there are multiple layers of doors here. There are one gate, two gate, three gate. After the third gate, we are in our upper room. Welcome to my casa. It's like a kitchen, dining area. There's a little balcony. Simple bedroom, AC, which is the most important thing. It's AC. It's from the warmth of the band. This is the best thing in this house. This is the best view of Mazatlan. Ta-da! Airbnb cost is around 800 pesos for two people. 800 pesos is around 40 dollars per night. One more important update that I have forgotten. I was at the mechanic in the morning and I was able to get the car in to the mechanic shop. It's 1.30 p.m. in the afternoon, peak, peak sun. And I'm driving around Mazatlan looking for a mechanic that will service our van. Yeah, it's just not safe to drive any further than this town. So I gotta get it fixed ASAP. I just drove 20 minutes from the Airbnb we're in. No luck with the mechanic. Driving 20 minutes back into the area where we, where we came from because our Airbnb host recommended an English speaking mechanic, so that's where I'm going. Peak heat, peak traffic, no food so far. Real struggles of that life. Yesterday, he was not a person, and he was too busy to look at our van. But this morning, I dropped it off and he called me back after about two hours and said that our upper control arm is broken on the passenger side so kafi uh, important part is because the wheel looks completely tilted in and it's just not safe to drive wobble or other kafi gadi while driving so unfortunately the problem is that park yampe nahi mil raha and he has to order it so he ordered it and he's going to get it tomorrow by afternoon hopefully the mexican timeline so pata nahi lagta kabhi kabhi late bhi ho jata so he's going to get it by tomorrow afternoon and he's saying that he'll be able to fix the van by tomorrow evening max so that's why we are still in an airbnb abhi next airbnb move karna padega luckily our airbnb host from this airbnb has another friend who has a place for us because this one was booked up so this airbnb is booked out we are moving to another one wrapping up all our stuff this is the traveler's life when it's bad, it's bad the old airbnb is in the corner after 2-1 hours, we came here. Here, all the houses are very colorful. Let me show you. Of course, there is a street dog. There is a street dog. Mexican street dog. Let's go. Here, Mr. Vasan Nangi is sitting. Hi. 
ये रूम में एसी है लिविंग रूम में नहीं है तो यहीं पड़े हुए हैं on our uh, standard evening walk for catching sunset there's no sunset today though sunset ke is bhi nahi hai jaise sim bolti hai dekhte you or n nikalta hai ki nahi aaj bilkul bhi chance nahi but it's still going to be a beautiful walk and i'm going to show you guys how the malecon of mazatlan looks like Mazatlan in the evening is a party center. Oh, like, oh my god. Crazy party center. Like ye to La Paz ke like 10x level hai. Party center La Paz bahut chill hai. Mazatlan everybody wants to just party and chill out right after work. Sabke haath mein daru hai. Like everybody is having a beer, cold one, watching the sunset, living with the city. Wild. Too wild for me. Yeah, wild is the way to put it. I'm a little scared. Loud music everywhere, but it's beautiful. I love this city. It's crazy. Hey, after sunset, ke baad, there's this uh, taco place. So, my Airbnb ke bilkul pas mein hai. That I've been wanting to try out. I'm gonna go check that out for dinner now. Should be good. Kafi beer aata wahan pe. So, I'm looking forward to some street food. We're here for dinner. Basically, Kathi ka dinner hai. Because meat tacos milte hain yahan pe. Raymundos mein. Wow, that looks amazing. I need that in my mouth right now. बिल्कुल इंडिया के लोकल ढाबा की तरह लग रहा है एंड आई है मैंने तीन टाको ऑर्डर किया है इसने एक पापा पोटेटो डिश ऑर्डर किया है एक कैसेडिया ऑर्डर किया है और एक डिजर्ट भी ऑर्डर किया और दो ड्रिंक्स भी ऑर्डर किया मुझे नहीं लगता आएगा दो सौ पैसा में ये सब कुछ ये है तेरा पापा चले हमारा बिल 160 और हमें बस 250 पैसों 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 से तो हम फाइनली ड्रिंक्स पी सकते Awesome shop, hooked it up. They fixed our van in such a short notice. Amazing. Had to get a couple of new parts, but the wheel looks so much better and straighter. I think we'll be able to drive on these safer now. If you look closely, that's the part that was worn out that needed to be changed. Because of this, the old part, the wheel was actually completely slanted inwards, and that's just no good for driving. These guys hooked it up really nice. Meanwhile, I took Everest to a much-needed spa day. Loading up all the food, all the stuff. We'll miss this beach. 